Time will tell how worthwhile was the struggle to save Ditchling from the hands of the builders, the men who believe that everyone must move with the times. Ditchling, with its famous 13th century church, is a Sussex beauty spot and village home of artists. It was proposed to build 2,000 model houses adjoining the high street of 17th century half-timbered cottages. But now, thanks to the protests of the villagers, the scheme has been dropped. It was decided that the new estate was unnecessary and would spoil the beauty of the countryside. One of the many treasures of Ditchling is Anne of Cleves' house, a lovely old Tudor residence which Henry VIII is said to have given to his fourth wife in 1540. The house was actually built about 1200. Anne's house, with its fine eagle's gate, is one of the best preserved Tudor specimens in the country. Relics of past ages are the Franciscan doorway, a grand old piece of ship's oak, and the stocks for mischief makers under the casement windows on the terrace that overlooks the old world garden. Time has already told the story of Ditchling's part in history. Ditchling wants to continue to play it, undisturbed.